What is up, guys? It is Uncle Bob. How is it going? Welcome to the channel. Welcome back. We are here for what I am. I'm planning. I am planning. Planning. Planning on being the penultimate episode of this series. Finally, after focusing on this game for now almost an entire month, because I haven't been able to beat it. And also I've been playing a little bit of Zelda in between. Because I gotta break up the monotony somehow. Um, after over uh, underestimating how long this ending of this game was going to take. I think we're just about there. We beat Barubari. If that's how you pronounce his name. I have no idea what it sounds like in Japanese. Um, but we beat him. And... I, am, I don't think we have a whole lot left to go, but um, I guess, because I, I don't know this in advance, you know, I do my, all my, all the voices, not voices, I do all commentary live, so I guess you guys will know how long this video is, and uh, yeah, I'm anticipating this will be a shorter video, and then tomorrow if I get a chance, maybe tonight, but I probably won't have a chance, um... I ended up having to take my daughter to just a checkup doctor's appointment today. So, not left with the most amount of time. But, you know, we do what we can with what time we got. So, yeah, we just healed ourselves up. Just drank at the Fountain of Youth. And now we can just go further i guess <coughs> all right luckily this place has a really crazy encounter rate so i won't have really any difficulty padding out the time of this video maybe we don't use as many uh you know uh lead off runaways Good turn. Good turn on everyone. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry. Oh, God. What did she want? Hold on. All right. My bad. Woman was just calling me about what we were going to do for dinner. And I told her we're just going to do an easy day. Um, let's just... We're going to get this specific brand of white bread. American cheese slices. Simple Swiss cheese slices we got stuff for tomato soup if I wanted to bother we would do it extra we would be extra and oh Jesus Okay, up is usually the way to go in a place like this, so we're going to not go up. You know what I'm saying? We're just going to walk around the border and figure it out. Get some phonage going. Okay, hitting the mage user is always super lame. Okay, not terrible. <coughs> Might as well. Wow, you have Typhoon too? Super lame. 
What a bitch. Good. Crit. Or counter. Mm. Mm. Do it again. Do it again. Do it again. Fuck. But yeah, we'll just do the classic good old grilled cheese and tomato soup shindigs. That'll be good. Thank you for hitting one of the people I needed you to hit. Off with his head. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, you see a big empty room like that in a game like this? That's almost assured. Assuredly. Um, you know what? That's still, that's still cheaper. But yeah, usually a big ass room like that, you're always going to want to go up. Why? I don't know. It just feels that way. Most of these old games, you get a space like that. Center room, you always go upwards. It's always like it's kind of set at the default. <coughs> it was nice. been watching videos of... Uh, I was looking up because uh, they announced that Marvel vs. Capcom collection that's coming out for the switch and i was looking up just different shit about it and uh come on counterattack! damn it this time nino nino shit Oh, God. What's this? Oh. Why? Why do you have that? Why is that a thing here? That makes no actual sense. I don't know why that's a thing. <coughs> But uh, looking at that Marvel collection that's hitting the Switch soon, I uh, I was looking up some of the names of the other games that were in it, because, you know, I don't recognize the rest of them, basically. And I didn't realize that... I knew there was obviously Marvel vs. Capcom 1, which I, and 2. Uh, 2 I used to play with my best friend a shitload. And uh, one, I remember I used to play at a lot of <coughs> arcades and shit back in the day. Let's see if this does better for the mana usage. Can't judge that one because it was a fucking special. Nice. Counterattack to counterattack. Counterattack to counterattack. Damn. But I remember I used to play the first one at uh, my dad's retired Navy. And occasionally we used to go up to his uh, Navy base to the grocery store because you, damn, they have a really nasty fucking, are you serious? We're fucking doing curses now. 
out of nowhere. Didn't I save a couple of these? Yeah, just for... This is why I kept them. You're, you're fuckers. All of you. Every last one of you. I hate you all so much. Okay, so wait, was that it? But we used to go to the naval base and, you know, my parents would do some grocery shopping on a discount, you know, my dad being retired Navy and it being a naval base. And uh, I remember the arcade area that they used to have in this place. It used to have the two games that I remember it had were, um, it was the original, well, not the original, but the big gauntlet arcade game and Marvel vs. Capcom 1. And I remember it was weird because... I had played it, and then a few years later, my buddy got the second one, and I thought they were the same game until I actually, like, played them and was, uh, or until I actually saw them in the thing and was like, oh, wait, no, this, I remember this now. Honestly, what, what, I don't even remember it. What I remember is you would pick two characters and then there would be like a third character that would get like rouletted in. And when I saw that, I was just like, yeah, I do remember this shit. So I remember after I saw that, I was like, shit, I do. I did play this game. Cause I thought I must've played like, cause I know there's a lot of, a lot of those, you know, this first that games. So I thought that that must have been, you know. I thought that must have been something that I just imagined. And turns out I didn't. I do. I did play it. Because growing up, I used to think that it was just like, oh, it must have been Marvel versus Capcom 2. It didn't. I didn't think it was, but I thought like, oh, well, it must be. Clearly. There we go. Oh, hello. We got a treasure chest in here. Let's see, for 10 MP. If this pops them for at least like 70 or 80, it's worth it. 90? Dog, that's way worth it. If I'm doing the dragon, there was no reason for me to use MP from Nina. Well, I guess I didn't know if 999 would kill him. That's why. Well, certainly did there. Most certainly did there. The King Helmet. For real? No one else can use it. I mean... Nope. Does not compete with the dragon. This should work. But yeah, I'm definitely interested in playing like the older games as well. Because I didn't realize that, you know, the way that the old games were like an actual series like that beyond just one and two. 
I didn't realize that the precursor to that was a game called X-Men Children of the Atom. And then what? Marvel Superheroes? And then X-Men vs. Street Fighter? Marvel Superhero vs. Street Fighter? And then you finally... And then it finally hits the... Okay, maybe we won't fight every single battle. <coughs> That's not what's supposed to happen here. That's not what I wanted. That's not what I wanted at all. Mm -hmm. Nice. That's what we call nice. Obviously, the one that I have the most experience with is Marvel vs. Capcom 2. And I mean, I guess due to age, like, 3 should kind of also be included in that, but I guess I just don't include it, and I don't, I don't really know why. Maybe that's unfair to the game. Okay, what do you do? Are you serious? Are you, are you for fucking, are you fucking me? Bro, I will, I will right here, right now, I'm telling you, dude, I will start this motherfucker, I will reset this game. Okay, okay, okay. You're such a... This game's such a bitch for that. That is a full-on fucking asshole maneuver right there. I can't believe the game would do me that dirty. Oh, yeah, I got to ask my son something when I'm done with this. Because he was supposed to go, he's supposed to go on a camping trip with my, my parents and grandparents and shit. But he was supposed to go out with Flipback. My younger brother, you know, my son's uncle was supposed to go with. And my, uh, my stepson the teenager was supposed to go, but, you know, we don't have, we just don't have the money right now, and I guess he doesn't, oh god, hold on, Gonna have to make a phone call that is about somebody that I don't necessarily want to have a phone call about, not gonna lie. Um,
Just hit him with the heavy one. Come on. Counterattack. 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 Give me one. Wrong guy. I mean, no. Just hit my tank. <laughs> Useless should not have done it. I'm sick. Death. <laughs> Murder. Whoop. Oh, why I thank you. Those guys are pretty tanky as well. I'm not going to lie. Especially when I'm quite a few levels ahead of where I was when I was at the start of this dungeon. And those guys, like those, what were they, the big hands? Yeah, they were pretty fucking tanky. And I'm stronger now, and I feel like these guys are much worse. Potential spam, not answering that. Okay, so that just took me right back to the same spot again. This one's not so bad. This one I can do. All melee, even with Nina. There we go. Come on, yeah, throw some counters in there. Throw some counters in there. Mm, possibly should have killed him first.
Oh, come on. Oh, I forgot he's faster. Sick. I'm hearing my daughter screaming out there. All right, well, there's only one more direction to go. We're just going to take it and then dish it all back to him. Not handling any part of this. No part. Zero parts. What did I tell you? It's always straight up. It's always straight up. It's always straight up. Any game, straight up. Always is. Oh, the music change? This is perfect. This is everything I wanted. Let's... Perfect. All right, guys, that is it for the day. It ended up being about a normal episode, about 26, 27 minutes. Uh, so, yeah, uh, next time, tomorrow, probably not tonight. Uh, tomorrow, we beat this game. This is it. I am done. We are done. We have made it. Tomorrow, we take on God. So, uh, yeah, talk to you then, guys. Peace.